Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another new video. I hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, I'm going to share about BFARM course, which was a highly requested video where I got the comment about average students, whether the course is difficult or easy for average students or not. So in this video, I'm going to cover everything. So please keep watching the full video. And before that, make sure you subscribe my channel. If you haven't yet subscribed my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon over there so that whenever I upload videos, you get the notification first. So coming to the point, so first, if you ask any good student or any topper student uh, that how the course is, they will definitely say that it is an easy course, the course is interesting like that. And if you ask any failure student, what they will uh, answer, they will say that the course is difficult to uh, score, difficult to pass, obviously they will stay like that. But why it is difficult, you have to understand then why it is easy for the uh, topper students and why it is difficult for the failure students. So to secure good marks in your BFARM course, you need to follow 8 main things and let us know what are the 8 main things which you need to follow to secure good marks in your BFARM. Number 1 is interest. How much interest you are having to do the course. If you are highly interested to do this course, then you will definitely secure good marks and it will be easier for you. If you are not having much interest in this course, then it will be difficult for you as you are not showing much interest in this course. Number you should attend the classes regularly if you attend the classes regularly if you note down the class notes regularly then it will be easier for you and if you don't attend the classes regularly if you are very irregular to the classes then it will be difficult for you make a habit of taking notes in the classes taking uh, running notes in the classes will help you to uh, learn more easier whenever you take a note in the classes it will be easier for you if you don't take a running notes in the classes it will be difficult for you whenever you study so try to make a habit of uh, taking a notes in the classes number four clear your doubts make sure that you have cleared all your doubts before your exams and try to interact with your teachers so whenever you are finding difficulty in studies then they can help you out and help you on clearing their doubts number five consistency consistency is one of the most important thing the student need to follow so if you are studying consistently then it will be easier for you it will make you feel easy learning and if you are not uh, following the consistency of study and if there is a gap between the studies then it will be difficult for you for example there are many structures and many drugs if you are not uh, consistently revising those on the daily basis then it will be difficult for you so try to make a consistency whatever you are doing number six you study hacks, tips and tricks. For example, you can make a chart and you can paste it on your wall and try to make it shorter the notes you take and try to revise the drugs. You can uh, also use sticky notes and you can paste it on your wall so that you can revise it anytime you want. Number seven, practice and revise regularly. Take a test of yourself whether you can do it or not. So you can uh, test yourself by making questions and you can also practice some questions which are easily available on the uh, different kinds of websites that are there nowadays. So you can go there and also you can practice some questions. Number eight, follow and refer good books. If you refer good books, then it will be easier for you and try to follow uh, course. If you want to make it feel easier, then you can refer course based books. There are many books which are semester wise course based books. Uh, some names which I can refer you that is Nirali Prakashini, there are books and also PV books are course based. So you can refer those books also all for today i hope the video was helpful for you and i hope you guys like this video if you guys like this video then don't forget to hit the like button and also comment me down what next video on you want and see you guys on my next video till then bye bye